Hi Foldscope community. My name is Holly Stewart and I'm the Education Specialist at Foldscope Instruments. This video is part of a series of videos to offer you some tips, tricks, and strategies on using your Foldscope 2.0. At Foldscope, we believe in providing quality scientific tools and equipment for everyone. So when we redesigned the Foldscope, we knew that the phone coupler was going to need an update. The original phone coupler is a magnet. Unfortunately, this magnet caused some interference in phones and some of the phones and tablets that people use to try and connect to their Foldscope. It resulted in wavy, wobbly images that didn't allow them to actually capture what they were seeing. To fix this, we removed the magnet from the coupler. The new coupler is now just a metal washer. Now what this means is that your phone is not going to just snap into place from the magnetic attraction from two different magnets. You are now going to have to physically and manually line up your phone coupler with your fold scope. The new coupler does have some features that help you out with this. There is a raised outer ring along the outside of the washer. This is just the right size to grip onto the outer edge of the lens magnet. And there's a hole in the middle. This hole is exactly where the lens will go once you get it locked on. So when you do take your phone with your coupler and attach it to your fold scope, you do, as I said, need to line it up and you will feel it lock into place. Once it does, your, your fold scope is on your phone and then you will be able to see your images and you can take pictures and record videos. Now we have a tool that allows everyone, all users, to capture their videos and images on their fold scopes.